With Harold on the form of his life and an England call up on the cards, his career was ended by a wild tackle during the FA Cup fifth round tie. It would be his last game as a professional player. Yep. You made it. <laughs> Little sis making headlines at the World Cup. I can miss that. <laughs> Knockouts now, huh? Yeah. You are gonna need all the help you can get. <laughs> Hello, Kim. Hi. Bee's in town too. Is that your documentary? Yeah, I got an A. <laughs> you can watch it if you want. Am I in it? Are you a hunter? I'm not what you think I am, Kim. Uh, I don't think you're anything. I mean, I, I don't think you're anything bad. I didn't. I am a I soccer don't... fan first and foremost, but I am a fan with means and resources that few others possess. Totally. Yeah, I, I hear that. You made quite the impression here, young lady. The press are saying that you could be the World Cup's next breakout star. I'm just trying to keep my feet on the ground. You know, you hear it all the time. Someone plays a good game, media makes a big deal about it, and the player takes her eye off the ball. Next thing you know, she's yesterday's news. Sometimes I forget you're only 17. Kim, with your ability, your level-headedness, you could blaze a trail through this women's game. Change the way the entire sport is perceived. People keep telling me stuff like that, but... I don't really know what to do with it. Don't do anything. Just keep being yourself. Kim, I can help you go straight to the top. Mark my words. Help your team win the World Cup, and they'll be making movies about you. So, um, I don't actually see my trailer anywhere. I assume it's part around the block. Your trailer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big 50-foot streamline I was expecting. I mean, it was all in my contract, all agreed. I mean, is this not L.A.? Danny, I'm I'm sorry. I don't know who said you would have a trailer. Oh, you're sorry? Ignore him. He's just having you on, all right? Doesn't know how to shut it off. <laughs> oh. Hey! Oh. Hey! hey. <laughs> nice. You, you really got me there. This is hilarious. Uh, do you guys know each other? Hey, boys. <laughs> no. Oh, what's up, mate? I didn't know they had you for this, too. Yeah, man. Love the boss skills at these events. It's fun to watch. Plus, I pick up, you know, tricks for myself. Sly. Hey, mate. Uh, Danny Williams. Ah, the Williams. I play with your big brother, Terry, at UV. Stuff. Oh, trains like he plays. Yeah. Yeah, he's a, he's a tough player, Terry is. Yeah. Uh, hey, we'll uh, have you boys set up uh, over here to judge the tournament. We'll present the Tangle League trophy over here, do pictures and signings over there. Cool, nice one. Yeah, looking forward to it. Sounds fun, mate. Uh, listen, I gotta jump over to player registration for a minute. Uh, I'll be back in a bit. Okay. Alex. Alex. <laughs> I, uh, I really appreciate you making this happen for me, mate. Well, obviously. Thank you. 
<laughs> I know what my son likes. Yes. Ready, ready to go? Yeah. We have reservations at La Torre. Oh, no. I totally forgot. Another time? The best in Madrid. You know what? We must take you some time. Alex, may I have a word? Alex, building a brand means getting exposure. It means being in the right places with the right people. Showing your face constantly, cultivating an image. Wait, this isn't about the logo, is it? I will always respect your decisions, Alex, even if I don't agree with them. And I know that you do your best on the pitch day in, day out. And I am doing my best to make sure that you get awarded for that. If we both do our jobs, we can achieve great things. Dinner's ready. Be right there, Mum. Alex, I can only do this with your help. Our strikers deserve nothing but perfect delivery from crosses. Today we will work on giving them exactly that. I would like to take a moment to call out Alex Hunter's training session today. Excellent, Alex, truly. It is the Champions League round of 16 first leg and huge expectations for Real Madrid to go far in this competition. How will they fare under the floodlights in front of the famous yellow wall at the home of Borussia Dortmund?
We're getting down to the nitty-gritty in this competition. Derek Ray here. I'm joined in the commentary box by Arsenal legend Lee Dixon. Oh, stop it, Derek. Really like those compliments. Thank you. Group stage is over. This is where the competition really starts for me. Mistakes at this stage can be really costly in knockout football. Dortmund at home, keep a clean sheet. That's the rule. Don't concede away goals. Look at Modric with the pass. This is the lineup for Dortmund. An element of caution about this selection. Yeah, 4 5 1, Derek. The five players behind the lone striker will need to support him. Looks a very strong midfield offensively and also defensively. The back four will be protected throughout the game. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central strike will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. Mario Götze, Guerrero. Alex Hunter ready for another night's work. What in particular do you like about his game, Lee? Well, how'd you stop him? Four go... And he's in the clear. Oh, just let Guerrero. And deliver towards the back post. Not really the ideal clearance. Here is Marco Asensio. Now Casemiro. It's with Alex Hunter. He's just a thorough reader of the game. And there we saw it. Tony Kroos. Real Madrid moving the ball with purpose. What can they do from this position? Can he give them the lead? The shot wasn't really far enough away from the goalkeeper, was it? No, but he picked up the flight nice and early. Toprak. A bit untidy there. Weigel. He had the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. He's in control of the situation. Well, they are the record winners of this great competition, Real Madrid. And you always feel, Lee, that no matter the stage of the competition, where Real Madrid are concerned, you're witnessing history. Well, absolutely. Their history would suggest that they need to win every game because the pressure is always on them, and quite rightly so. And very well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. Hunter. Marco has set. Well, visionary passing. And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. And this is Weigel. Amazing reflexes from Thibaut Courtois. Oh, it's fantastic. Every team needs a brilliant goalkeeper. And this lad falls into that category. Here is Marco Asensio. Read it superbly to take back possession. Big club though they are, Borussia Dortmund don't regard it as automatic being in the Champions League every season. So on that basis, Lee, they're determined to enjoy this round of 16 experience. Yeah, absolutely. I think teams won't relish playing against Dortmund, to be honest with you. They're... Tremendous vision. He's really sliced them open. Well, that's the end of that for now. Now Casemiro. And well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. And Witzel with it. Here's Gutzer now. And there the first half end. <laughs> Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Maximilian Philipp. Hunter, Marco Asensio, Alex Hunter gives it a go, oh my goodness, what an outrageous hit, I can't believe he took it on from there, and neither can the goalkeeper.
Well, let's have a look at it again. He catches the keeper asleep, back on his heels. He wasn't expecting a shot from that distance, and neither was I. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. And they're playing once more. Real Madrid with the lead here. It's with Weigel. Maximilian Philipp. And one thing he does know how to do is shield the ball. This is Gareth Bale. This is Kroos. Casemiro failed to hang on to it. Dortmund have been awarded the free kick by the referee. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. And you need your defender to take charge. It's with Alex Hunter. Bale. Now Casemiro. And a fine pass placed by Alex Hunter. It's there for him. So now a corner. Corner kick played in. High class defending right on the goal line. Just wanted to get it out of there. Here's Gutzer now. And Isco doing superbly to win back possession. And Marco Asensio. It might really appeal to Isco. Well, clattered away. Modric. Look at Modric. Can they convert? Going for power there, but just too much elevation on the short lead. Yeah, over the bar, Derek, with pace. He's a little unlucky. Kagawa. An authoritative challenge. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Good numerical situation. It's Kagawa. Guerrero losing possession a bit easily and no nonsense defensive clearance Lukas Piszczek with it attending to his defensive chores Kagawa Philip dealt with easily by Courtois Kagawa. Guerrero. They couldn't maintain possession. Isco. Given away by Real Madrid. And Marco Asensio giving it away. And this is Royce. Terrific save by the Belgian. Oh, Courtois at his best. What a fantastic save. And a deep ball in. No nonsense clearance. It's Kagawa. Now, sometimes for a goalkeeper, it's not about the spectacular, it's about the routine. Absolutely. Concentration. Concentration. It's all between the ears. This is Gareth Bale. And the decision is one of offside here. And in the second half, the signs are positive. They can't relax, Lee, but they ought to be pleased. The Real players have to focus on not making any mistakes in order to protect that slender lead. If a bit of magic from the opposition gets them back in it, there's little you can do about that. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Isco has it. Here is Marco Asensio. Inside the final two minutes of this contest. So plenty of forward momentum from Ray. Oh, surely. And Isco has scored.
Well, it's not a brilliant goal, but it's a goal. It's in the back of the net. Keeper couldn't do anything about it. Well, let's take another look at that goal, shall we? It's going their way, 2-0. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Top rack. Kagawa. And Witzel with it. Guerrero. Axel Witzel. And Kagawa. And a goal for Borussia Dortmund. Celebrate, young man, celebrate. It's a brilliant finish. Well, 2-1 it is here. Isco has it. This first leg is over and Real Madrid have prevailed. What did you make of their performance tonight, Lee? Well, we said before the game how important it was for Dortmund not to concede against Real Madrid in that home leg, but they failed to do that. But they've still got the second leg at the Bernabeu to go. It's not over. Thanks, Lee. And just a friendly reminder, we'll have live coverage of that game here on EA TV. So join us then.